First of all, I want to thank the members of the organizing committee for inviting me to participate in this uh, process. I think it is a rich one, and it is all about a profession and a practice that I find very dear to my heart. I myself took a very long route home, and I call home human resource development and, by extension, management. Uh, so it is something that is pretty dear to my heart and one that I speak with a lot of passion about. I will bring uh, an experiential view of uh, the whole matter of philosophies of HRD. Human resource development in this environment is one that must be focused on delivering value. And by delivering value, I am not thinking only or defining that value to uh, a, a profit, a bottom line for a company, but it's about how we go about harnessing the skills, competence, the attitudes, all the attributes that one brings your, 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 your learning, your, in, your socialization, how do we capture your very essence, develop that, mold that into a passion where you are delivering your very best. And in delivering your very best in a cohesive way, in a forum that is in a forum that has common, a common culture, how do we develop excellence through that? And that, I believe, is where we need to focus. How do we get the very best from people with their varying understanding and learning? It takes a myriad of initiatives, activities to do that. But the starting place must be to understand that each individual comes with a set of uh, values, comes with a set of competence that as leaders we need to harness. And it is our task at leadership to do so. So as we travel the subject, how do we transform local organizations into global uh, organizations? I think where I would like to look at it, some of the nuances within the Jamaica organizations and how we can really uh, focus on changing, building, uh, revamping thoughts and actions in order to develop and build those global organizations. It will impact the philosophy of HR, but more than anything else, it will create value. And value is where we as a people need to be, to be able to operate and take our place fully on the world stage. So I look forward to speaking about how we actually can do some of those things.